A local vitamins and supplement brand is not only focused on improving health, but is also creating opportunities for Filipinos who want to increase their income. Recently, this brand bagged two international awards. Here to tell more about their achievements is iFern President and Chief Executive Officer, Tomani Tan. Tomani, great to have you with us Hi, on the I final word. Long time no see. Long time no see. It's been several years since the last time yes. we saw each other face to face. Congratulations, Tomani, on these awards. What do these citations mean for you as a boss and your employees? Okay, uh, thank you very much, uh, Rico. Uh, the first award is a World Branding Award uh, from London. is the most eminent uh, award for, uh, for brands. Um, and we have won this award for the third time in a row for our uh, flagship product, Ferndi. Uh, of course, everybody knows we've uh, been having the pandemic for the past two years, and no less than a World Health Organization is telling everybody to take vitamin D. So we have benefited mm. because... Um, we are selling a world-class vitamin, uh, world-class vitamin D, but it's at, at an affordable price. And it's our third time to win, the first time in 2019, 2020, 2021, because during the pandemic, our sales have continued to grow. Uh, so what it means to us is um, because this is voted by the consumers, uh, market research, uh, brand valuation. Mm -hmm. So it means to us that many people have been benefiting from our product. And many, are, many people are taking it uh, to prevent COVID and for right. COVID treatment as well. So, and we definitely need vitamin D, uh, Tomani, definitely, to improve definitely. our immune system. Yes, yes, <laughs> that's true. And your firm uh, has won these recognitions uh, consecutively for a few years now, as you mentioned. Yes. What is yes. the secret to iFern's success through the years? Uh, the secret number one is the quality products that mm. we we sell. Uh, I'm a graduate of uh, the Asian Institute of Management, and our professor said, "Tomani, you need to create a world class product that is affordable." And that always stuck in my head. No? So every time we launch a product, it has to be world class. I need to be supplied by the either the number one or the number two raw material supplier in the world. Otherwise, I will not sell the product. And then it has to be affordable at the consumer level. Otherwise, I will not sell it. Also. And so just so happened that the basic vitamin Ds that uh, the basic vitamins that we promote are the mm. ones needed by the human body. Of course, at the start of the pandemic, people were talking about which vaccine to take, which one is better. Now they're taking they're talking about booster, booster shots. But more important than that is the personal immunity mm. that you can only boost by taking vitamins. And our 500,000 iFern distributors, which we finally call iFern Nation, are everywhere no when uh, when there were the lockdowns so we shifted to uh, offline uh, from offline selling we shifted to online right and there, because of that no we we were able to bag the ASEAN business award right. uh, uh, SME excellence for growth because we were able to grow uh, consistently from 2019 to 2020 to 2021. And that's because our people didn't stop. No, we were able to pivot. We were able to adopt a strategy that was able to conquer the pandemic. We were able so, to, so, yes. So, Tomani, you know, um, you have been a success over the past uh, decade. But you know what? Yes. Many of our entrepreneurs also suffered uh, during yes. this ongoing health crisis uh, the past 20 months. What is your advice to them on resilience, perseverance to overcome the odds? Okay, very important is you know not to to feel defeated. I I, uh -huh. I told my people if you don't give up, you're not a failure. So the moment you give up, then you will consider yourself a failure. So what we have taught them is to find answers, to find solutions. No, to uh, if there's a wall, then go around the wall. You know, dig a dig a hole under the wall, break down the wall. So when the quarantine happened, nobody was allowed to go out. So we taught all, our, all of our people how to use the Zoom, how to use Facebook Live, how to use all of the different messaging apps. And, you know, because nobody was able to go out, we have very high numbers of people attending the Zoom meetings, right. watching our Facebook Live, yeah. uh, watching, um, you know, interacting with our posts. And now that the quarantine has eased up, our marching orders to our people is okay. You are not allowed to go out. Start going out. Start knocking on doors. Mm. Start talking to people. Start having the meetings that you were not allowed to have before. Wow, so, brilliant. Brilliant. You really have adjusted 
and uh, pivoted you know, to the changing times. Yes. And what great advice uh, that you're lending right now to uh, entrepreneurs um, who have uh, fallen amid this pandemic. What are your plans for iFern in 2022 for your employees and consumers? Well, uh, we just came back from a big trip in um, Abu Dhabi and Dubai. No, we spent two weeks there uh, to, you know, to immerse ourselves mm -hmm. no, and to have fun no, with our top distributors. And one thing we realized, you know, the place is crawling with Filipinos. Uh, the last data I checked, the Middle East has 2.2 million Filipinos. And the vision of the company is sharing prosperity through entrepreneurship. And our hope no, is to, able to, to be able to go out of the Philippines and to able to bring back no, some of the uh, OFWs who've been working so hard abroad, sending money to the Philippines. You know, I'm telling people that there's a lot of money to be made in the Philippines. You just need to know where to look for it and what type of business to join. So right. um, we have created the system we call the iFern system. We say iFern is the key, iFern the system. Mm -hmm. And now we're telling people, kailangan tamang kumpanya. No, you need to be in the right company. You need to look for better opportunities. Of course, our company is direct selling. No, in the Philippines they call it networking. The moment they hear networking, oh my God, scamian, uh, pyramiding yan, di magtatagal yan. You know that company is not gonna last. So my message to the people right now, to entrepreneurs, mm. people who lost their jobs, people who lost their businesses, you know, have an open mind. It's right. not about okay. you know having a bad reputation. It's about what have this company done during the pandemic. You know, we have won this. Two international awards, no very reputable award-giving bodies, mm. the ASEAN no less, no world branding awards from London. So these are awards given to a Filipino company. You know, we're not even a big company. We're just a small company from the Philippines who believe in the Filipino spirit, who believe in the entrepreneurship ability of the Filipino. And we have able to conquer the pandemic. Right. We're able to have people buying new cars because that is. The cars are a, you know, they would say a luxury, but when the pandemic happened, the public transport was removed. So, yes. you know, buying a car has become a necessity. And during the pandemic, we're so proud to say that uh, we were able to purchase 600 vehicles no, for our yes. iPhone distributors that before, you know, they they only existed because of public transport. Now they have their own cars to drive, Brilliant. To, you know, pick up, pick up products and yes. to deliver products. You have given so much hope to uh, the Filipino, and you have built a world-class Filipino brand. Congratulations to you, Thank Tomaritan you. You, of iFern.